Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Geomographic. Right now I'm in this beautiful village called Iseltwald. It's said to be one of the nicest ones here in the Bernese Oberland. Well, looking at the turquoise shades of the water and the many beautiful houses, I think this could be true. If you're new to this channel, my name is Jemo. I'm a Swiss traveler, mostly posting videos about Switzerland and Southeast Asia. If you like this kind of content, then definitely write in this channel here and you're most welcome to subscribe. Alright, and now let's tour a little bit around the village and after that we can come to a conclusion where it is one of the most beautiful ones in this region. The first thing you need to know, Isseltwald is best to be reached either by boat from Interlaken or Brienz or else by car by taking the highway. If you arrive by car, you have to park it at the entrance of the village and then you need to hike down for a couple of hundred meters. After a few minutes, you will arrive at the village where you can walk along the shores of the lake. On sunny days, surely it's going to be a great idea to consider a swim. So if you want to visit Isseltwald, you can actually take this steamboat here. It departs from Interlaken, it will take you to Isseltwald. And then after this, you could also proceed to Giersbach or Brienz, which are also very, very beautiful places. And well, just take a look at this boat. What a beautiful piece of heritage. It's actually a steamboat with wheels, which is even more unique. Now myself, I'm ready for a swim. I really can't wait to immerse my body into these turquoise waters. Surely it's going to be great. Before I'm going to swim, small advice from somebody who has been swimming all his life in the river. It's highly recommended to not directly jump into the cold water because you could have an accident and that's really not cool. So instead, prepare your body slowly by first immersing your feet into the cool water. And then what you do, you just dip your hand, you put a cold water all over your body. With that, your body is getting used to the temperature. And after that, you slowly can go into the water and then you can enjoy it. It's still quite a bit cold. It's only 16 to 17 degrees. But with this panorama, it's very, very enjoyable. So myself, I won't stay longer than 10 minutes because I think it's just too cold to stay long. But in July, it's definitely going to be warmer, maybe around 19, 20 degrees. And then it's definitely going to be fantastic. After a swim, you can continue exploring the village or go to take your lunch. There are a couple of restaurants that serve pretty good food. I'm now here at the restaurant Strand Hotel in Isseltwald, having a fitness teller, which is basically a piece of meat with assorted salads. And from here we also have a great view over the lake of Brienz. The next part that you should check out is the bay. On the way, you'll be seeing a lot of beautiful wooden houses. Many of them are decorated with flowers or ivy. 
Once you arrive there, you can see many sailing and motorboats, as well as people doing pedalo or paddleboat. Furthermore, the bay is also a great place to go for a swim. Now going to the pier. <laughs> yeah, really, really nice. Feels like a fishing village. Really great atmosphere. Then this over there, that is actually the castle. The castle of Isselwald is a building of historic significance. Especially because of its location at the tip of the peninsula, the castle has been a very popular subject for photography. Sadly, it is not opened as a museum and thus it cannot be visited. For the last decades, it has been used as a center of congresses and health resort. There is also this nice beach bar in here that I highly can recommend you to visit, especially because of the atmosphere and the personal that is very friendly. I'm now at this place called Lake Lodge. The view is really great. And myself, I'm having Aperol Spritz, which is a mixture of Aperol, which has this nice orangish color and Prosecco. It's a very popular drink here in Switzerland during summer. It's very refreshing and it tastes very nice. It was really great here in this restaurant called Lake Lodge. We loved having him here. Thank you very much. Mega merci. Merci. Good. Cheers. Bye. The upper part of Isseltwald around the castle is very nice to visit. Thus, make sure you don't forget to walk around there. On the way up, you also can access the boat rental station. If you come here, then you can actually rent a boat or one of these pedalos here, which is really great, especially around this place where the lake is so still. It's definitely going to be a very enjoyable activity many houses around the bay. This place is just so relaxing. Then continue as if you would try to visit the castle and then walk along this road. Most likely in here you'll be alone as I assume most of the people will be around the bay or the ferry boat station. In addition, this place is a very beautiful photo spot with all the houses, gardens and the lake in the background. I really love this walkway here. It's so enjoyable. There are many gardens. And then also the restaurant where I just had lunch. You can see it's really beautifully located. Some people are doing paddle boat. Ah, this village, <laughs> it really hit me. So enjoyable, so beautiful. Wow, Isseltwald is really, really a great place. I enjoyed it so much. The atmosphere in here is very, very enjoyable, very calming. We've reached the end of this video and now I'm able to answer the question whether Isseltwald is one of the most beautiful villages here in the Bernese Oberland. Well, I actually think it's not only one of the most beautiful villages in this region, but I think it's actually the most beautiful village of Switzerland. Ooh, poor Morcote, yeah. So most likely in my next video, Top 10 Villages of Switzerland, you might see Isseltwald on the number one. 
So that's it from my side. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give this video a like, leave a comment, share it to your friends, it would be really awesome. Also, if you're new to this channel, then you're most welcome to subscribe. I really appreciate that. So that's it from my side. We're going to see each other very soon.